Hi there, this is Steve Miley, the market chartist on behalf of forextraders.com and we're now going to look at the uh, still positive tone in here for the US dollar um, against most major G8, G10 currencies um, and particularly looking here against uh, the Australian dollar and New Zealand dollar. Both these currencies weakening against the US dollar so uh, through the, the latter part of um, of April in here we saw a significant sell-off in Aussie dollar but as I said primarily due to uh, US dollar strength um, but also some um, perceptive um, um, perception of Australian dollar weakness but US dollar strength driven by a higher yield moves um, but even though we had this little bit of a rebound in here to start off May uh, negative pressure is very much intact and we're looking for um, a more bearish theme to resume and bigger picture if I go out to um, the daily chart in here we're looking for having broken this 75 level for this double top pattern looking for lower targets here 73.68 73.30 one um, as we go into May. Similar story for the New Zealand dollar, triple top pattern on the New Zealand dollar on this sell off that we've had in here through the second half of April through 71.51 broken psychological 70 double O um, down to 69.83 again early May has seen consolidation uh, but the bearish pressures from the April sell off very much intact and looking for deeper targets over here um, down with a 68 maybe 67 big figure as we go through into the first half of May. This has been Steve Miley the market charters for forextraders.com and I wish you a great trading day.